All right, well, tonight in York County, authorities are investigating the cause of a fire at a small church. The 100 year old building in the Clover community was destroyed yesterday afternoon. It took six different fire departments to put out the flames. Yeah, and today WCNC Charlotte's Indira Esquiva returned to the scene to see what was left and what happens to the congregation now. As Pastor Shirley Brown walks the grounds of her 21 member church in Clover, she looks for yes. evidence. A little story for Christmas to prove what she's been preaching for more than 40 years and finds it in ash-laced Bible verses. Say he's a good God, he's a good God. A fire destroyed Pastor Brown's church on Monday. I see a lot of memories in here with the church people and um, I see a lot of tears. Pastor Shirley Brown says her heart is at peace with what happened because in her lifetime she has seen many miracles and to rebuild her church she will need one more. Do not have any insurance, no. Despite a lack in insurance and a lack of funds, Pastor Brown says she knows her church will reopen and those who know her agree. I have faith in God and there's a reason for everything. And I know this church is going to be open one day and there's going to be so many people coming in, they'll be standing outside. If faith as small as a mustard seed moved a mountain. My mind is made up and I'm going to serve God and walk with him to the day I die. This is my calling as a little girl. Pastor Brown's faith can, at the very least, rebuild a church. In York County, Indira Esquiva, WCNC Charlotte. Hopefully they do get that miracle. You know, the York County Sheriff's Office and South Carolina Law Enforcement Division are investigating the cause, but Pastor Brown believes that it was faulty wiring in the old building that caused the fire.